I thought yesterday was a microcosm of his whole campaign, where he has a flash of mm -hmm. maybe he, this is a guy who looks like he could be president. But he had a long enough history that I don't think many people bought that. He turned to the Mexican president and said, it's a great honor. I consider you a friend. He was speaking in diplomatic terms. Mm -hmm. Right. But the minute he landed back on United States mm -hmm. soil, soil, that speech last night, if there was any question about a softening, he could not have gone harder. This was a primary speech from last year. He talked about a new special deportation task force. He wanted to leave no question that there is amnesty. There will be no amnesty. If you come in this country illegally, we will find you, we will uproot you, and we will remove you from the United States. So there was a softening in the afternoon. Right. Mm -hmm. And, and something happened. Yeah, and hardening it now. Had him yeah. change things. I, 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 Can we get rid of those the radio? But, but his words, his words, not ours. But, but when you when we're, we're, we're journalists, and we just yeah, please don't. When you that's can, not when funny. you consider the day, though, the the one issue that propelled his candidacy, the foundation of his candidacy. Yeah. He walked away from it in Mexico City, returned to it in Phoenix, Arizona, in the space of six hours, from 4 p.m. Eastern till 10.30 p.m. Eastern. So, can I ask this Eastern. question? I defy you to tell me what his immigration policy Can is. I ask this question of anybody around the table? How do, you, how do you have one issue that is your key issue, which is building the wall? Which is so the stupidest much so, thing I've right. ever heard. So much so that that is the punchline in your rally, right? Mm-hmm. And then you go to Mexico, and you claim you don't even bring it up to the Mexican president. How 